Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well. So let's see what's coming through for you. What do you need to know right now? Okay, so straight away I have playfulness and wedding. Okay, I like this reading so, so far. Flirt, okay, two more cards please. Two more cards. So what do we have in here? Pay attention to the red flags, okay. And one more card, okay. All these cards wanted to come out. So what do we have in here? This could be the one, codependency, what else? New love and unrequited love. Okay, so if you um, are in the relationship at the moment and you feel like things are a bit rocky at the moment, just please pay attention to the red flags around you. Try to observe things from a different perspective. Try to see things how they really are. Try to kind of take a step back and just see things how they really are, okay? Because for some of you, there might be some sort of uh certain things going on behind your back you know or let's say your person might all of a sudden become cold towards you or just whatever the situation may be but you are being advised to pay attention to those flags um also for some of you i feel like you recently just went through a breakup that was very painful but you are really working on your healing which is great keep doing that okay but there is somebody coming away and then this person is going to be somebody who is very um he's gonna they're gonna start um by flirting with you just to kind of test the waters and then you know like it's gonna be um some sort of, some sort of playfulness which is absolutely normal in their relationship um but i feel like you will give them a bit of a hard time only because you have been very hurt in the past and Please make sure you do your inner work, okay? Because not everyone that's coming away is here to hurt us. And this person is actually, you know, the one. This could be the one for you. So please, you know, don't give this person a hard time. Just work on your healing. And um, again, I feel like your ex-partner, you know, um, they actually still very... Um, What's the right word? So basically, they don't want to let you go, okay? I feel like they still are very... They can sense your energy and they just kind of forget about you, you know? They they really want to come back and uh, try uh, to make things work with you again. But I feel like for most of you, you're not going to take them back, especially if this person has been cheating on you, lying on you. Obviously, uh, you just take what resonates with your situation. I'm picking up on different situations or scenarios in here, okay? Because I can see in here, somebody has been cheated on, somebody has been, you know, just lied to, um, somebody has been very codependent on the other person. But regardless of your situation, just know that things are going to be okay. And again, if you are single, there's somebody coming your way, they're going to be, you know, this person is going to be the right person for you or your true love and they're going to offer you a wedding and things are just going to go just as, they should and how we all want to in a relationship okay but for some of you uh just as i mentioned before you know there has been some sort of cheating and uh if this is not your situation i feel like for, um, a part of you they are actually in some sort of um situationship okay just know that again you have to try to see things from the right perspective and um you're basically involved with somebody who are married already. Children may be involved in here as well. So please just be careful because um, you are being advised basically to just kind of keep an eye on these red flags. So for example, for some of you, this person, they just want to have fun with you. They don't want to let go of their family. So again, just please be careful, okay? Because you don't want to end up getting hurt. That's all I'm saying, okay? You decide what you do with your life. I'm not telling anyone what to do, okay? I'm just reading what I can see in the cards, okay? So let's see. Zodiac sign. What is the zodiac sign? You are dealing or you are dealing or... Scorpio. So this could be your energy. This could be your ex's, your ex-partner's energy. Or this could be your new partner's energy. They can have resonates. Okay, let's see what the tarot cards have to say. Because so far, I really feel like there is quite a, quite a few scenarios in here. So just take what resonates with your situation and just, and just leave the rest. Okay, so let's see 
what the cards have to say. Okay, this one wanted to come out. Okay, so I have Ten of Wands. The Tower. Four of Swords in reverse. <coughs> Excuse me, I have a Six of Cups in reverse. King of Wands. Page of Swords. Okay, two more cards. Okay, so just as I mentioned before, for some of you there is some sort of a situation ship or third party situation, 1000% in here. Uh, and for some, I feel like this person is trying to kind of figure out what to do, but at the end of the day, they feel like they have to uh, stick to their family and uh, they just have to accept things as they are. They're not going to leave the family for you. Um, this is what I'm seeing. I'm sorry, but this is what I'm seeing. Now, for some of you, I feel like because of them not leaving their family, okay, I feel like there might be some sort of uh, breakup going on for those of you that are, or that, excuse me, are involved in a third party situation. Um, I have the hermit as well. So also, if you are going in a relationship and I feel like uh, you just find out that your person has been cheating on you or lying to you, again, you are going to, you know, just break up from this person. You're not going to put up with any more things and have the sun. And uh, if you are in, um, if you are alone, then, you know, things are going to, I feel like at the moment you're just kind of taking your time and just do you, which is great, you know, just concentrate on yourself and just heal your um wounds and just do you you know take each day as it comes okay but for those of you that have been going on through a uh, breakup or if you are going in a situation you are in the relationship which are uh, things are a bit rocky at the moment i feel like you are trying to find your mental strength you know you're trying to kind of just take each day as it comes but also you're trying to see things as they really are you finally getting that clarity that you really needed and um for most of you, just as I mentioned before, the cards are repeating themselves. You are just kind of, you find out something, you decided to break um, away from this person and you are just concentrating on yourself, you know, on the future. You are finally growing up. Um, you you feel like this breakout kind of um, made you feel more mature, you know, like you see things in a better way in the, from a different perspective um and you just kind of decided to let go of the past so that is good keep doing that you know um work on yourself you know look forward to the future the things that you can do and how to grow and make you feel better and stronger and um yeah that that's really good so far and i feel like this new person that is going to come your way you know this person is going to be energetic you know there's somebody who is very optimistic very confident uh, there's somebody who they're doing very well financially and uh, this person is very funny very charming i feel like they're going to have a, a certain way with the words that i feel like that's going to make you kind of get your attention very fast also, this person is somebody who is very motivated they, they know what they want from life and they're just going to go and get whatever they want to get in life and this is somebody who is very proud very uh passionate as well but they are very honest so i really feel like when this person is going to come around you you just know that this is the right person for you because you will know that oh this person is very well spoken and they're just very charming you will know when this person is going to be around you okay now um again for some of you i feel like this person to come into your life it might take some sort of time because you still need to work on your healing or maybe because you still work you are working on your healing you're not going to notice this person quite yet but that's okay you know you just do you and everything will happen in the right timing okay and um if you are in a third party situation or in the relationship that things are a bit rocky i feel like you are being very careful at the moment or like planning certain things for your future um and you are really kind of thinking before you're speaking or thinking uh, before you're taking certain decisions so you are um just kind of taking very things very seriously in your favor if i can say that right now so that's good okay now um i feel like again you are going very deep within yourself and you're kind of really thinking clearly and uh, really thinking what to do because again you don't want to be stuck in that relationship that things are not 
working out and uh, or again you don't want to be stuck in the third party situation from what I'm seeing in this course because let's say this person decided uh, they're not going to leave the family for you so obviously you're not going to be the second wheel uh, of the car if I can say that you know or um, just a, somebody just for fun you know what I mean um, so I feel like you are just going to kind of just kind of get that strength within you and you're just going to break it off okay it's either you or that person or it's either uh this person put it in the work if you're in a relationship with uh, rocky problems at the moment and you know like i feel like there's there's going to be some sort of boundaries that will lead you in the right way okay and all the things that no longer serve you they're going to kind of just move themselves away from you if that makes sense okay because look i have the sun and this is all about success you know things uh, looking brighter for you or brighter future everything is going to be just as it should be uh, also i feel like that for some of you um even though you are having some sort of problems in your relationship but nothing as serious like cheating or lying or, or anything like that maybe just a simple argument you know, things are going to get themselves sorted and somebody in here is going to get pregnant. Now, if you're in a third-party situation, please be careful because I really feel that some of you are going to get pregnant and as soon as this person is going to find out, they're going to leave you behind, so please be really careful. Uh, but yes, I feel like there's a lot of good luck coming your way regardless of your situation, like third-party situation, you know, breakup, new person, you know, you name it. There's a lot of luck coming your way and, uh, you know, it's the future is looking brighter, so what else can I say? That it is pretty much what I'm seeing. So I really hope this video helped. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you soon in another video. Bye.